free. The Snowden savings are only available at your local Ashley store. A new year is a time to believe in the power of possibilities. The clean slate gives us a chance to aim for any goal that we might have. Well, at Siskin Hospital for Rehabilitation, they are always helping patients reach their goals. And in just a few weeks, you have a chance to join in celebrating some of this year's greatest success stories. Jay and Cynthia Dale are here to get us excited for this year's Possibilities Luncheon coming up mid-March, right? Yes, yes, yes March 13th. Great to see you. Thank you. Yeah, so we kind of share a common bond that people would not really ever want to share, but we both have daughters yes. uh, who have benefited greatly uh, from the services there at yes. Siskin. It's life changing. It really is, it really is. Um, our daughter Caroline had a terrible accident and um, had some uh, spinal injury, but has recovered greatly. But without the help of Siskin, um, you know, it, it just it just made it so possible. Mm -hmm. we, we had great therapists and doctors and nurses and cheerleaders and it was just it was a fantastic experience it, it's at a, a horrible time station that you find yourself having because it's like that true ripple effect once yeah. somebody hears oh you had somebody at mm -hmm. siskin me too me too me too uh -huh. me they uh -huh. have touched so many people they have in this community they have and when you know someone who needs that kind of service it, it's all you can do mm -hmm. to not say Here's where I think you need to be. Right. <laughs> you know, right. when that happened, people were texting us, like, yeah. this is where you need to go. Yeah. Reach oh, out yeah. to Siskin Rehab. They'll take yeah. care of her. They'll right. Take care of you. Yep. So, the thing that I think is so wonderful, too, about the Possibilities Luncheon, and y'all can talk about the speaker who will be there, mm -hmm. it's highly motivational uh, when you are there to realize what somebody can do to fight through. Absolutely. And, you know, we, we were so, it was such a benefit for us to be able to send our daughter there. But there are so many people who, mm -hmm. who may not have the opportunity. And that's what the Possibilities Luncheon is all about, really. Mm -hmm. It's to provide scholarships for men and women who otherwise might not be able to, to have that world-class care that they mm -hmm. really need. So, so it's really great. That's what, what it's for. It's a scholarship. It, you know, they give out about $800,000 every year in scholarships. So uh, the speaker this year coming in is who? Quite yeah, I want to make resume. sure I say it right because yes. it's a tongue to Command Sergeant Major Gretchen Evans, and she's very well decorated. And in 2006 in Afghanistan, she had a mortar blast that threw her against a concrete bunker wall. She lost 95% of her hearing and ended her military service in, in major brain trauma. And so in 2022, she actually won the Pat Tillman Award for service at the ESPY. So any sports fans out there know the ESPYs. Mm -hmm. So I'd encourage you to go watch that video, but she won the Bronze Star. She's gonna be an amazing speaker, yeah. very right. inspirational. So I'm really fortunate to have her. Yeah, so these, if you've never been to the Possibilities Luncheon and you can find a way to go this year, you'll see when you get there, mm -hmm. uh, because she will come out and she'll probably speak for 15 minutes or so. Mm -hmm. um, and but then you also have a chance to see local people yes. uh, and see their stories mm -hmm. and you realize that you can't define Siskin Hospital for Rehabilitation as just one thing. You really can't. You can't. And I mean I even encourage people to, to volunteer there and just to, I don't know, just to, just to be a part of it and see what's going on. Mm -hmm. uh, when Caroline was there. I got a chance to see, you know, the therapy mm -hmm. rooms and this and, is during COVID. And you were um, able to stay this with her. Yeah. during COVID, so I was, you know, able to stay mm -hmm. there, you know, with her and, mm -hmm. and really just witness everything that happens there. So my daughter Emily was was there, not as an inpatient. Mm -hmm. It was a visits that we would make, and it was a difficult to define and diagnose situation with her. Mm -hmm. So we were there very frequently, and the patience level that was there, the insistence on figuring this out yes. that was there. Mm -hmm. And you even like one of our closest bonds was with a nurse yes. who was there. Everybody who works there, works there with a passion. Yes, we had a CNA that loved, and I'm, I won't say her name, she absolutely loved to sneak us cookies from <laughs> the cafeteria downstairs because they are the best cookies. If they've changed them, they need to change it back. Right. But she would she would sneak us cookies every day before her shift ended and yeah. just kind of talk. She was she was younger. We just talk about you know stuff, you know yeah. boys, and they laugh and cut up and mm -hmm. and so it was really nice. I think you know, and we could talk all day I'm probably, yeah. but um, we, when you love somebody mm -hmm. who is walking through a very difficult time like this, part of the yes. pain is that it's not quick. Right. And so to have a bright spot mm -hmm. that feeds your own needs yeah. um, when you go, it really means everything because it's very easy to give up. It is. It is. Yeah. And luckily, you know, Caroline's injury wasn't, it was, it was bad enough, but there are some that have, you know, suffered some severe spinal cord injuries and strokes and yeah. trauma. And it's for all generations. They've got some yes. very specific, like they've got a car that mm -hmm. you could learn to get in and out of the car and 
and different uh, occupational and yes. things that you might be doing at home, like a kitchen. And so it's for all generations, of course, but right. very unique uh, therapies. And you mentioned the world-class nature of it. It is. I mean, it mm -hmm. might be in our backyard off of East 3rd Street, mm -hmm. but it is most definitely world-class. Yeah. It is. It is. And people come from all over the region, all over the mm -hmm. area to, to experience Siskin Hospital. And so we're just, we're very lucky here in Chattanooga to have it. Yeah. Um, I know that a lot of businesses like to buy tables and let yes. their employees yes. have a chance to go and hear. There are still tickets available? There are. Individual seats are $125 for each person. There are $1,500 table sponsors plus um, other um, sponsorships. So you can just head over to possibilities.siskinrehab.org. Check out any other um, sponsorship opportunities you might want to take advantage of. Okay. Um, but we would love to have, you know, everyone in the community come and just see what's, yeah. what's happening. You there. will leave inspired Absolutely. to live your own life in the best way uh, and not say no for an answer. So exactly. Thank exactly. you both. Thank, thank you. Very much. I think y'all are co-chairs of everything. <laughs> <laughs> it's an honor and a privilege. It is such we an honor Chattanooga. and a privilege. Yes, very much so. He makes it look so easy. Reigning champions Ilya Malinin, Isabel Levito, and Chuck and Bates defend their crowns at the